Hello. Who is getting their shadow? No, Earth signs. We already did you. You just got done. Anyway, we got fire and air left. So, who gets it? No, Earth signs. For Christ's sakes. Ugh. Air signs. And the star reverse. Lack of communication. Probably a little bit of arrogance, right? Okay, so we're gonna do the spread differently because. I don't feel well, so it's going to be different. Newcomers, you, you can always look at the past ones if you have no idea what I'm talking about. Return visitors, you know exactly what I'm talking about. It's that topic. But anyway. Air signs. This is for Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Check your chart. Resonates with you. Good deal. If not, don't worry about it. Just boop your nose and wave it goes. Right. Right. Naked before the stars. That's almost like the star card right there again. Huh. And she's not exactly naked. She's in lingerie. Whatever. Ah, uh, let's see what her little read is supposed to be. 18. Naked before the stars. The moon phase is the first quarter, and this stage is acceptance. Accepting our own beauty in size, color, age, and fat. The visual seed is a beautiful, curvy woman wearing lacy lingerie. One is a black corset, and she kneels in her full sensuality under the light of a million artificial stars. Huh. sentence there is no perfection that is worth enough there is imperfection as proud as the heavens going dark what do we see when we look in the mirror do we see something we like or something we dislike something we care what something we care about or something we are a slave to this book is written so weird i swear what do we compare ourselves to do the stars of a media firmament leaking into our real life? To the social models, to the beauty queens and kings of the eternal pageant? To our inner self, to the idea we had when we were younger? To the eyes of the people loving us? I wonder what feelings the words curvy, cute, chubby, fat, rounded arouse within us. If a smile, or distaste, or recognition. The quest for beauty is not an empty quest. Even if beauty is not as deep as the ocean, still, when we shine, our world becomes brighter. But we will always feel naked in front of the stars. We should just learn not to blush and stand proudly. That's an interesting one. Alright, get your signs. Let us go ahead. I'm going to lay all y'all out together. And then I'm going to read it in fucked up order, because that's how I do. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> we wing it in these parts. Rawr. Okay. So. Ah. Gemini, that is your card, first off. Then we got the Libra. And then we got a little Aquarius. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to turn that over. Well, fuck it. It doesn't matter. I was going to show y'all anyway. Libra, you have the... Jesus Christ. Oh, wow, and y'all are in your element of air, too. Hmm. Let's see. Y'all are just in elements of air outright. Like, Aquarius, you're just running for fucking fight. Like, the Page of Swords is over here. The Ten of Swords is just dying over here. You're running in just to go murder motherfuckers. Like, you do not care. Like, that's the spirit. I like it. But the other two, Libra and Gemini, you guys are kind of stagnant in position, I feel like. Gemini, you're gathering information because you feel like something ain't, come, something ain't adding up to you. Like, Temperance Card Reverse could be with a Sagittarius, right? But it's like, something isn't adding up. Like, some shit ain't coming together, and it's got you wondering, like, hmm, why is this cup and this cup so different? But it might have you regretting 
what you're figuring out right here too. You might be offered a fourth solution from somewhere. But I feel like, no. It's something that you find out. Ah, Libra, you I, I have the Ten of Swords. You feel betrayed because the tower came down and everybody fell out the building. Everybody just collapsed out the building. And you feel like there's no point in waiting or... Hmm. Like, if this was the after deck, I would say, like, there's no more excuses to send, but it's like you're just cutting it off. Like, the tower moment came and, and possibly cut this off for you, or you did it yourself, but something with this betrayal just completely destroyed this foundation, and now everything with it is just halted. Aquarius, you're just you're going in for a fight. You know. And someone might offer you biscuits. Delicious biscuits. Or pentacles. The page of pentacles. You might be running in to try to do something. This person's like, oh, well, I got manners, do you? Mm -hmm. And then that leaves you, like, really confused. It's just like, why are you being nice to me, motherfucker? Like, I thought we were going to battle a little bit this week. Hmm. I thought we were going to do something exciting. Let's see. So, Gemini. Yeah, it's gonna be something that like you were picking up on, and then it got confirmed. Like the high priestess dropped her keys. Could be with the Pisces. She's just like got this shocked look on her face. Like I can't believe this actually happened the way I thought it would. Um, and now I gotta be gentle with the motherfucker. Like you know, or it's a. Mm, those two came out together again. It's interesting, but now it's reversed. <clears throat> I feel like someone gently let you down. Like they were, like you saw it coming and you were kind of shocked, but you knew it was coming. But the issue is, is like, um, they're so gentle about it. All you can do it really is empty your cup this week. You're just kind of like, ah. Na, na, na. That sadness, like definitely releasing those emotions, but it's just like eh, whatever, I guess, you know. Yeah, uh, look at that. Definitely no more excuses to keep it going with you, Libra. That was huh, that's kind of fucked, just a little bit, but still, it's it's definitely like there's not enough birds to fly out a message that someone's gonna get this shit. I'm totally crawling back in my bed. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just like being spoiled or whiny today because I don't feel good. I got a flu shot, so fun, fun. All right, one more. No, actually two more because I literally thought, okay. But yeah, it's like shit's getting cut off and now nobody can send stuff to continue. Yeah, it's just like, no. I mean, if the Eight of Wands was here, he'd probably be pointing at that bird, honestly. Yeah, like, there's no more excuses for whatever. Libra, you might be recognizing this week that whoever you were dealing with is a completely unfair prick, you know? And you might have to huff it while these people watch you. You know, you might feel broke, you might feel left over, and these people are watching you, but you're just like, I'm not sitting in the snow. I'm not. I am digging my stuff. I'm heading somewhere. Uh, this stuff might, like, everything that you're dealing with this week might make you feel... Like, you have the ability. And, like, well, honestly, the girth. Uh, like, look at her build. Look at her build. Look at her. Would you want to fight her? No, because she could sit on you. And that's terrifying. Because that means she doesn't have to get up and you don't have to breathe. Like, you know, it doesn't even matter. You are definitely, like, carrying your shit. And you have the ability to do that because you've grown. Like, you know, yeah. I guess that, uh, wow, this deck is like really messed up. Because that's literally what it was saying earlier. What are you doing? You psycho. This bitch ran out the house this morning. Like. And then started playing with us. Trying to get us to chase her. She led my husband around the house like three times. <laughs> mm. Pardon me. <clears throat> 
Uh, maybe I should just move the shadows to Saturdays. I don't know. It's up for you guys to decide. Let's see. Alright, Aquarius. With your week, you know. Yeah. This person offers you something that just leaves you fucking indecisive as shit. Like, you ran in ready for an argument, and then they just let you win the argument without arguing. And you're just like, what? So it's like, now... Huh. Someone took one pentacle. Letting the rest sit and grow for the harvest. Um, someone might even be coming over to check on somebody. And mind you, pentacles can also be flowers. So someone might have taken this flower after growing it and giving it to the person who is resting Aquarius, trying to be like, here. That could be the exact same thing this page of pentacles is doing. And it, it takes you coming out of an acid trip to kind of see that, like, I don't know, like they kind of invested in you in a way that you weren't expecting and you were surprised that like, I don't know, but I feel like you really don't... It's almost like you recognize that they care, but it's in such a fucked up way, it confuses you. And leaves you like, what? Okay, whatever, man. You know? It's just one of those things. Anyway, that's the end of the reading. Air signs, right? So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um... I mean, I don't know if you like the spread, because I kind of do. But maybe next time I'll do them one at a time so we're not just being fucky with it, you know? But anyway, you guys take it easy. I will see you later. I love your faces. Bye-bye. Ah.